Yeah, I'm standing by. Vice President Quayle will be approaching shortly. <clears throat> Roger, I got that one deep throat. The eagle has landed. Tweety is out of his cage. He's flying over the cuckoo's nest. Three minutes till Condor. <laughs> Who are you? Dickie Peterson, Chair Above Justice. Here to protect and serve. Well, the Secret Service will take care of this kid. The last thing we need is some guardian angel troop hanging around here. I am not a guardian angel, sir, nor do I care to be, unless they start returning my phone calls, but fast. I don't have to step behind that line. Go undercover, mingle with the crowd. Roger! I know this is against chair of regulations, but uh, you're a secret service. I think I can trust you. Woodchuck? It's my code name. Use it sparingly. I'm only in an emergency. <laughs> you are gonna eat that, aren't you? Yeah. Okay, I'll be right there. <gasps> Unauthorized disposal of classified documents. I'm gonna have to put him on report. Also, leaving his post, two more demerits. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna have to secure this perimeter myself. Who's <laughs> heading? <laughs> Sorry about that, miss. Merely a trained reflex reaction triggered by potential terrorist activity. For all I know, that hot dog could have been a Scud missile and its Bundy mobile launcher. You are an idiot! <laughs> Sticks and stones may break my bones, miss, but names are not gonna put that hot dog back in your mouth. Sure, go ahead, get another one, I'll do it again. Situation resolved. All right, everybody, surprise inspection. The second most powerful man in the entire world is gonna be by here any second. And I swear by this trademark yellow beret that every man, woman, and child in my sector will pass muster. Hey! Newsflash, 60s are over. Get a haircut, transvestite! <laughs> Suck in your gut. <laughs> I better check into home base. Woodchuck the gray squirrel, woodchuck the gray squirrel. Come in, gray squirrel. Dickie? Is that you, Dickie? Yes, gray squirrel, it's woodchuck. Is it woodchuck? What are these magazines I found under your bed? Uh, merely reference material for the uh, scenario file of my Cherubs of Justice crime lab. No, it's not. It's filthy smut. When you get home, I'm going to take you over my feet. <laughs> uh, uh, you break it up, gray squirrel. Maintain radio silence. The vice president. Did you see the way he looked at me? Did anybody see that? I think we had a moment there. Hey, what's that guy doing? The vice president's in trouble! Sorry, I didn't see you. Who's he? I was aiming for the trash can. Oh, I'll bet you were a taxi driver. <laughs> bet you didn't count on Dickie Peterson, human shield, getting between you and the vice president, did you? Unfortunately, I don't have the authority to detain you at this moment. But I promise you, mister, one day it'll be just you and me. And then, boom! <laughs> Death touch. <laughs> Woodchuck the gray squirrel, Woodchuck the gray squirrel. Evil plan aborted. Tweety is back in his cage. Sylvester once again has been thwarted. Judging by the length of my shadow, it is about 1,800 hours, uh, which means it's time for a chair of chow. So uh, get those ding-dongs ready. I'm coming to Great squirrel, it's locked. <laughs> 